Nyaza Lesufi plotting to oust Ramaphosa while well, a shocking political twist has unfolded within the AMC. Panyaza Lesufi, the premier of Gauteng and a powerful figure within the African National Congress, the ANC, is reportedly setting his sights on a much larger political goal. According to insiders, Lesufi is plotting a bold move to unseat South African President Cyril Ramaphosa with plans that could radically reshape the leadership of the ANC and South Africa's political future. This daring ambition comes amid growing discontent with Ramaphosa's leadership, both within the ANC and across the broader South African political landscape. But this isn't just about removing Ramaphosa. Lesufi's reported plan involves much more, including the potential return of former President Jacob Zuma and an unlikely alliance with the leader of the economic freedom fighters, Julius Malema. Lesufi is not a newcomer to the political scene. While as Gauteng Premier, he has gained significant influence and established a reputation for his assertive approach to leadership. However, his remote plan to challenge Ramaphosa signals a dramatic escalation in the internal tensions that have long simmered within the ANC. Or the ANC, which happens to be the party that has led South Africa since the end of apartheid, is facing increasing internal divisions, and Lesufi appears to be positioning himself as a force for change within the party. But with that change comes a big risk, both for Lesufi and for the ANC as a whole. While the potential return of Jacob Zuma is perhaps one of the most controversial elements of Lesufi's reported strategy, Zuma, whose presidency was filled with scandals involving corruption and mismanagement, left a complicated legacy when he stepped down in 2018. While his re-entry into the political arena could reignite debates over corruption, state capture, and governance that have long plagued the ANC. However, Zuma still holds significant influence among some factions within the party, and Lesufi may see him as a valuable ally in his quest to unseat Ramaphosa. One other key component of Lesufi's plan involves Julius Malema, the outspoken leader of the economic freedom fighters. Why Malema and Lesufi have been political rivals in the past, their potential alliance could send shockwaves through South African politics. Malema's appeal to younger voters and his fiery rhetoric have made him a formidable force in the country's political landscape. Or by partnering with Malema, Lesufi could broaden his base of support, particularly among those who have grown frustrated with the current leadership within the ANC. Well, Ramaphosa is actually ahead of this, and of course, he's the one being caught up in the middle of all this drama. While well, Lesufi's plan is not without its risk, the ANC is already deeply divided, and any attempt to challenge Ramaphosa could further fragment the party. Or well, in the lead up to the next national elections, the ANC will need to present a united front if it hopes to retain power, while well, Lesufi's ambition may push the party to the brink of a split, which could have far-reaching consequences for both the ANC and South Africa. Additionally, the return of Zuma and potentially a partnership with Malema could alienate key members of the ANC who are opposed to corruption and radical political moves. Well, as South Africa grapples with a range of pressing socio-economic issues, we're talking about unemployment, poverty, and rising inflation, believe me, stability within the ANC is more crucial than ever before. Tell me in the comment section, I mean, do you think Panyaga Lesufi's plan to unseat the Maposa could succeed? Again, how would the return of Jacob Zuma impact the ANC and South Africa's political landscape? Well, could an alliance between Panyaza Lesufi and Malema change the future of South African politics? Last but not the least, what do you think are the main challenges facing Sri Maposa's leadership, of course, under the ANC? Leave your thoughts just down in the comment section.